Hi guys, BP here right here. Got something kind of cool today. My friend Brian, who is over here, wanted to stay out of the picture, um, ordered a <coughs> custom demarining. Dave's over there coughing up the lung. He's already unboxed this thing, but I haven't. He told me it was pretty cool. So what I want to do is kind of go through this. It's not, I guess, just a bat in a box like you would think it would be. So let's open this thing up and check it out. Oh, you, you just, you just looking. Huh. Okay, so we have the DeMarini Customs box. Not just a regular old box, it's kind of interesting. Carved out D on it. Yeah, it's got that tip. Pretty cool. Mm -hmm. A little carved out D on it. So let's uh, open this booger up and see what's inside. All right. So this is the what do you say? You got just the flipper OG. Seventeen. The seventeen flipper OG. Pretty cool little box there. Went through, put some foam in. What's in this? I'm gonna tip that up so you guys can check that out. Maybe eh, good enough. <clears throat> so let's see what we have in here before we get onto the bat. Some documentation. D Marini Customs. I'm not gonna read all that to you, but it's uh basically looks like a thank you letter for buying a D Marini Custom. Got some pretty cool looking stickers. You gonna put these all over your bat, Brian? You what? You gonna put these all over your bat? No. On the back window of your car? My car, yeah. You got a little DeMarini keychain. So let's dig this thing out here. Set this aside. All right. That's interesting. They Basically, I guess put the foam in there so it doesn't bounce around. Did this come with a wrapper on it? Nope. Really? No wrapper. This thing is impeccable. No imperfections. Nothing of the sort. Looks like this here might be a little bit raised. Just from probably being applied after uh, maybe the, the bat has been painted. I kind of thought that would be part of the graphics, but it's not. I don't think it's going to peel off or anything. I can't catch it with my finger. So it's un obviously under some kind of clear coat has the custom model number of FLS 17 CSTM. I don't know if you can see that on there or not. And this is the standard 2017 flipper construction. Features the alloy handle, 13 and a half inch. What they consider to be a balanced barrel is approved for ASA. <clears throat> this is a very slick looking bat. You know, you just basically get to pick your layout and then all your colors and your grip and your end cap. This is all the things that Brian went with. He put K-Squad on the barrel here for his co-ed team, Kryptonite. You can only put nine letters on this. But hopefully we don't get a chance to hit this thing soon. Obviously we're going to let Brian put the first hacks on it and get some action in with it. I should have a 17 flipper aftermath coming soon as well so we can compare these side by side. So that'll be fun. You know, <clears throat> I was surprised that it didn't just come in a plain old box. So the presentation was cool. Bat looks good. Can't wait to get to the field and try it out. Thanks for stopping in and checking this out, guys. Be on the lookout for this review coming soon, as well as many more. Subscribe to the channel to keep up with all that. You can like this video and share it around with anybody you know that might be interested in getting one of these. And you can comment wherever it's posted with anything you got to say or any questions or anything like that. Thanks, guys.